Am I? Ten. Ten. Nine. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Booster ignition. Four power engines and liftoff of the Falcon 9 and Pace. Helping keep pace with our ever-changing ocean and atmosphere. Stage one propulsion is not full. All nine Merlin engines lit up and roaring. 1.7 million pounds of thrust. Power and telemetry nominal. Makes its steep climb into its orbit. Right ride about two minutes on the first stage. A view from the rocket camera. Beautiful supersonic. Here we hear Falcon 9 supersonic coming up on maximum max Q. Maximum dynamic pressure on the launch vehicle. Max Q. Pass through max Q. The vehicle continues to perform nominally. All nine engines. Firing. MVAC engine chill has started. Starting to chill the second stage engine to get that ready. They bleed a little bit of locks in there so it doesn't uh, get thermal shock once they light it up. A view there, looking down the first stage booster. Getting ready to cut off the engine and separate. We'll have a number of uh, milestones all happening quickly in rapid succession. We're about 10 seconds from the engine cut off, and then we'll have stage one, two, sep, and then stage two, ignition. Nico. Stage separation confirmed. There it goes. The first stage of the rocket. Second stage now lighting up. Ignition. Stage one boost back startup. You see the glow of the first stage as it falls away. I'm excited to see that first stage come back here to landing zone one uh, this morning. That uh, will be great as stage two continues continues to perform getting that stage back here will be exciting if you're here on the space coast and you're watching get ready for a double thunder clap at just about t plus seven minutes seven to eight minutes the double sonic booms of the first stage booster breaking the sound barrier as it returns to earth stage one boost back shut down so now the first stage has positioned itself on a return trajectory back here to landing zone one, which is only a mile or so from our location at Hangar AE, we get quite the thunderclap. <laughs> yeah, I'll, yeah, always love to hear the landing zone back here when we're in the hangar. We're about uh, 10 seconds away from uh, jettison fairing of the payload fairing, uh, exposing pace to the atmosphere. This is a big moment for the spacecraft team. Fairing separation confirmed. Looking inside, there go the fairings, revealing the PACE spacecraft to the elements. I love that shot, I'm seeing the coast of Florida come back into uh, view. Two more burns left. Stage one entry burn startup. That's the first one, the entry burn, for about 30 seconds. You see it lighting up now. Grid fins are out to help give it a precision landing, guiding the first stage booster back to landing zone one. Split screen now. Well, we did have it. There's stage a shot. Two FTS is saved. There's a shot of the booster coming back down from the ground. Stage one entry burn shut down. Stage one FTS is saved. 
right, and in comes the first stage booster. Second stage continuing on a nominal trajectory. It continues to uh, look very well during this flight. Stage one landing burn. All right, there goes the landing burn. In just a few seconds, we'll have a booster on the ground. A look from the ground. We hear the yeah. thunder here at yeah, We hear those e. double claps. Landing leg deploy. Here she comes. Stage one landing confirmed. Another pinpoint landing by the first stage booster. Flight number four for the first stage in the books. Second stage continuing to burn. Once they get those solar arrays deployed, a critical moment, they're going to be looking to get power on it. There goes Pace. Payload separation confirmed. Off into space on its own, flying free. We've got applause here at the Mission Director's Center at Hangar AE. Looks like a good separation. Vehicle pretty stable. 